Saturday afternoon. <sighs> I'm froze. It ain't really cold out, but for some reason I don't like awful cold. So I finished my motors. I got a little coffee here, it's probably cold too. Uh -oh. 310, 33 degrees. If we can move it around, I'd be warm. So, use my new grinder. Shut up, I'll put it back on. So, I took all those computers apart yesterday on my live stream, so I have a... Uh, Big old mess to clean up now. So, all this has to get out of here. That's got to get out of here. Means I have to break the uh, um, plastic faces off because these are aluminum, these two boxes. <coughs> Rest of that shred. <sighs> so, I've been bouncing back and forth on this stupid copper, uh, whether I should take it or not. Um, I don't really want to go all the way to hell up to the other yard just to take my copper out there. Um, so I'm thinking I might just hold on to it. I don't know. Because I still have to clean all that. And right now I'm at like 300 pounds of copper. Just number two. Um, so yeah, I just... Still have a lot to add to it, <clears throat> so I'm thinking. Um, Jesus, I think it's. What is that? Transformer? Airplane? Yeah, it was an airplane. That was weird. I don't see any airplanes anywhere. Huh. Strange. That hum like, is almost like hurting the ears. I don't see a plane, so I don't know what the hell it was. Oh, well. So, anyway. Um. I got... This is all I have for number one. I mean, there's you know, probably 30 pounds there, maybe. 25. Um, these are going to go with me to the scrapyard. Well, not those. The ACRs, the uh, heat sinks. So I'm going to take these in. Uh, this is all just aluminum. That's going to go Monday. This pile of aluminum here that was back behind the house. That's all going to go Monday. Ugh. All of this shred here is going to go Monday. All of that shred there is going to go Monday. That's aluminum. I'm going to do that furnace either today or tomorrow so that can go in the shred. Um... And then all those computer cases and stuff that are in the garage here. That's all shred. But I'm going to put all that at the end. Um, after I get all the, the goodies loaded. So I went through all these yesterday. Got all the uh, batteries and crap off of them. So if that whole tote is ready to be sorted and put in its appropriate containers. Here's some more up. Uh, more noodles. So, yeah, I'm thinking I'm just going to maybe sit on my copper for now. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Um, if I sit on it, maybe the price will go up a little better. I got a bunch of transformers there. I might dig those out and take those too, just to get rid of them. I don't really want to tear them apart. 
I'll have to see what the price is on them. And I got a couple buckets here of die cast. There's a little bucket there with some motors in. I'll probably get that out of here. Some toroids. I might keep the toroids. I don't know. But um, I think I might just, like I said, keep the copper and the brass. Um, and then when it's time for me to put the down payment on that house there, um, if that comes through, then I'll have a good chunk to put on it. My hands are froze. I got gloves on. So, I don't know. Just too many things going through my head. But this is uh, number one, number two. That thing's heavy. This is all number two wire. So I finished those motors up today. So, yeah, between that bucket and that toad, it's like 298 pounds. So that's a good start. And then I got brass. Brass is like a dollar twenty a pound. So I might just keep that as well. I don't know. We'll see. And I already have a uh, I already have uh, stuff loaded in here. I got a uh, Cast aluminum and that MLC crap, and then there's a copper loom radiator there. So that's her. there was a uh, over 200 pounds of that MLC, but I separated some of it because I want my yard manager to look at it and make sure you know that's where it goes. Uh, I don't want to lose money or mix this stuff up. So What's this? Uh, you can let me know on that. This here, like I said, it's only this. Uh, uh, probably gas valve, the wires. I don't even know if I want to take that reducer motor off of there. Scroll cage is here. The motor for that's already in the garage. So, that's what I've been doing today. Came out here about noon. You can get out of bed till, I don't know, 10 o'clock, something like that. That's a cover off that big, uh, gaming computer that was on my desk yesterday workbench whatever you want to call it so that's about it those cores probably don't pay nothing but I don't want to really sit and take them apart my name ain't Ian Matthews oh you know what I want to look at since I just saw it let me see if my wheel is dead center See, Ian, look at Mine's dead center. Dead center, buddy. How'd you get one that was off? Huh. I don't even... It has a guard, but when I got it, it didn't have the screws for it. So, it's actually like right here. There it is, right there. But I took the adjustment nuts off and all that crap. But, yeah, mine's... But mine still kicks off to the thing. And no, I'm not going to make a plate and drill a hole through a bolt and all that bullshit. Ain't nobody got time for that. So. Alright, guys. So that's what I've been doing. Um, I went in the house yesterday and I came back out and I was out here till I don't know, 8 o'clock last night just getting stuff done. So. And also, I think what I'm going to do, just to ease my mind, is I'm going to find the right tool uh, when I go Monday. And uh, I'm going to buy 100 pounds of these, which will be $35. But I'm going to make sure that they're copper. And then I'm going to break them all down and add it up and see... How much money I lost. Um, I mean, if copper goes up, that's good. Because, I mean, you'll have the copper, you'll have the aluminum, you'll have the metal. So, just to, like I said, because I've been going back and forth on this, and I, the numbers that I'm doing are not feasible. So, uh, you know, that's 
going to make it not worth it, but just to uh, ease my mind, I'm going to uh, I'm going to uh, just buy 100 pounds of them and see where I'm at. So with that being said, I'm going to sit here and watch this guy who thinks he knows what he's doing, but I don't know. I see it. You ain't going to point it at me. I understand. You and your server. Throw it in the shred. Get it over with. Look at this. 20 people watching. 8 likes. Y'all suck. You all suck. So just so I don't suck. There you go. I gave him a thumbs up. Alright guys. Appreciate y'all. Stay safe out there. Um, let me know what you think on the copper. Should I uh, sell it? Store it? Um, it's kind of a situation where you need the money, but I don't need the money. Um, and when you get a, a, a good, you know, amount like that, you hate to start getting rid of it. So, let me know your thoughts. And, um, I will talk to you all later. I've got to get back to work. Later, guys.